Good morning everyone, Greg Ross. We're out trapping tips on the 27th of April 2023. So I did a video uh, yesterday about using certain kinds of peanut butter and I showed you this jar of peanut butter that someone gave me but I'm not going to use it on my traps because it smells a bit stale and I don't even know what brand it is. So I put it out here to see if there's any rats around and I set a trap beside it. And yes, there are, there is a big rat. So I did make use of that peanut butter by using it as a lure. And this rat had been feeding on it for two or three days. And then I put a trap out and uh, he got nailed, literally. He's on, he's impaled on a couple of those spikes, but he's a big rat, very big black. And if I hadn't had the spikes on that trap, he would have quite likely got free from it. So I think this is one case where the spikes have really paid for themselves. And I'm glad to get him before he got across to my place over there, because he could have made a mess. Yeah, so I'm going to reset that trap because there could be more rats. I don't know if this is a male or a female. It's a female. So yeah, there could be a female, but she's not, she's not lactating, so she doesn't have a young one. <sighs> okay, well done. I'm happy with that. Okay, so thanks for liking, thanks for subscribing, thanks for watching, and thank you especially for being a supporter by buying the Rat Trapper's Handbook, available from Amazon. Good trapping, everyone.